All right, guys. Out on trap line, super windy. So wrapping the season up, basically. Let me show you what we got here. We got a road coming up out of here. Try to go slow so you don't get seasick. A big road coming off here. Of course, it goes all the way down the hill into a big bottom. Well, we got a, a set here that Scott Rainbow called, Rainbow calls it the kitchen sink set. We got a bunch of different lures on there. Well, we caught a coyote on here uh, a couple weeks ago. They say you can't catch a coyote on a big backing, but we did. Of course, nothing today, but got a scent post set there. It didn't hit. Bear with me, though. I don't know if you can see it. There's a snare in there, cable restraint. Probably see it hanging in there now, maybe. But anyway, let me tell you what we've done. There's a big heavy trail that comes up out of this road, cuts around here, and goes up the hill into these pines on this ridge top. We hung a, a restraint there and we've got a couple out the ridge. Neither one of those have hit yet. Of course, you can't see it, but I'm gonna show it to you when I get down there. This ridge runs all the way out this, it's probably, I don't know, four or 500 yards. And then it drops off down here where this road goes into a big field. We caught a cat down there a couple weeks ago. And there's a big trail, heavy trail coming off the high wall that the coyotes are using. And if you'll give me a second, give me a second to get down there and I'll get right back with you. I'm back with you. To you, it was only a minute. To me, it was 10. <laughs> See what we got. We got a dead coyote right here in a cable restraint. One thing you guys can remember, in the mountain state, we don't have entanglement laws. But we do have restraint laws. You can't use a snare that has a locking lock must be relaxing but as of right now there's nothing that says you can't run them against something and and choke them out i don't normally do that but on these properties i've been trapping that are private i'm not too worried about it because nobody's supposed to be here but i was telling you about that ridge i don't know if you can see it i'm gonna show it to you there's a big heavy trail coming out it actually was coming right by this tree and of course he's he's tore up jack in here now but if you look, this is stuff you need to pay attention to. The big heavy trail that comes through here, it goes right down there, it goes right by that little pine sapling. And it runs right through there and up into that draw. Well, if you'll look, that's that ridge that I just showed you that runs all the way out. Those are those pines that comes out in that road up there. Those coyotes sometimes will run that road, but they'll also hit these deer trails. That's what that is. It's not a coyote trail. It's a deer trail. And they're running around that deer trail. They're coming all the way around this ridge. And then I'm not going over through that mess, but there's a trail that comes off the hill. It comes down through this stuff. It comes right by here I just showed you. And you can see it going right through there. It comes right out by this, this pine tree. And what they're doing is they're coming into this big field. It goes all the way on out. My finger's messing up. Way on out through there. All the way around through there. Of course, there's my truck. And you can't see it, but right over there is where I caught the cat. That's that big three-way intersection we just did that video on. So when you find these trails and you're setting them in areas where you don't have to worry about a guy's hounds, find these trails these animals are using and set these restraints up and pick these critters up. Very simple. Find the trail, stick them low, 
I run 10 inch loop, 10 inches off the ground, and you'll pick these coyotes up. This is a uh, 57, number 57. Today's the 25th. Trap's gotta be out by noon on Thursday. So we got a few more days hoping for three more. Anyway, I hope this helps you guys. Um, if you need me, holler at me. God bless you, have a good day. Catch you somewhere else down the line.